Today I have the brand new Culture Fly The Office subscription mystery box. This is a quarterly box that Culture Fly offers. I know Culture Fly does quite a few mystery boxes. They have like the Friends box, they have the DC, the World's Finest Collection box, which I do like every quarter. And I just recently have subscribed to the Office box because I'm a huge fan of the Office. And this is only their second box that they have done. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna crack this thing open. I'll talk more about this. So this is $36 a quarter if you pay for an annual subscription. If you pay for a whole year ahead of time, it's $36. If you only pay for just a quarter at a time, it's 40 bucks a box. So you can save $3, or actually $4 a box by paying for the entire year up front. So you know you'll save like you know 16 bucks, but you know whatever. So let's say if you if you did the quarterly box or if you paid for the entire year f for a year, then it's 36 dollars plus shipping. So it's a pretty fair value. In my first office box that we had the last quarter, it was fantastic. I kept a couple items from it. I sold the rest. I made over double my money back on the first office box. It was full of Dwight Schrute items. Some of those items sold for like 20, 30 bucks a piece. That box was a money maker. If you got the first office box, that was a money maker. Yeah, I kept, I think, two things from that box, sold the rest, got over double my money back, and got two things for free. So hopefully this new office box is just as good as the first one. But go ahead, I'll show you the box, kind of show you what it looks like a little bit. Sides. Now just the box by themselves are actually are pretty cool. Here we go. Now some people keep these boxes, they, they actually, they kind of collect them. Let's see, this box is full of stuff. T-shirt first. It is a dark gr or gray, dark blue t-shirt. Of course, brand new with tags. It's the official office branded clothing. And what do we got? Oh, cool. Greetings from Scranton, Pennsylvania. Where it says Scranton, you've got your Dundee Award, you got your Beats, you got Michael Scott's World Best Boss coffee mug, there's your Shroot Bucks, there's the, the uh, Stapler and Jello mold. Sweet. That's actually a really cool t shirt. This is a 3XL, but it actually is a slim fit cut. So, yeah, this is not going to fit me. So, yeah, I'll be selling this. I do like this shirt. This is actually a pretty cool shirt. But yeah, this is a slim fit cut, so it will not fit me. But new attack, size 3XL. This is called the Welcome to, Welcome to Scranton at Graphic T. So this will be available for sale in my eBay store. There's a direct link down below in the description box to my eBay store. I'll actually go ahead and I'll leave like a link to Culture Fly if you want to check their boxes out. Then I'll leave my eBay underneath of that. So there you go, first item. I bet this shirt sells for 20 bucks. I'll probably list for 20 bucks, I'll probably sell for 20 bucks. Okay, next we have. Let's do this one first. Dwight K. Schrute has a pin on it. It says, Dwight, at 8 a.m. today, someone poisons the coffee. Do not drink, oh, do not drink the coffee. More instructions will follow cordially. Future Dwight. So this is the episode where Jim Halpert played a prank on Dwight and uh, like faxed him stuff from future Dwight. Fantastic episode. That's actually pretty cool. Then you got the pen with the copier fax machine from the office of Dwight K. Schrute. So actually, I'm keeping this. The last box we had a letter from Michael Scott written as if I was a new employee. I kept that. That thing was funny. I'm gonna keep this too. I like that. This is just, this is so random, but I just kind of like it because it's kind of like a almost, in a weird way, this piece of paper is kind of like a movie prop replica in a very strange way. It kind of is. Oh, we had this. We have a bumper sticker. WUPHF.com whenever, wherever. Little sticker. Oh, here's actually the cheat sheet that came out with the other stuff. Let me hide that. I don't actually want to see the cheat sheet yet. Too soon for that. What is it? There is so much stuff in here. Okay, first, oh, we got a purple bandana. You already know what this is from. This is Michael Scott as Prison Mike. Whenever he was wearing the purple bandana in the episode. Once again, another just super funny episode. 
And if you do collect like Funko Pops, Funko did actually make a Michael Scott Prison Mike Hot Topic exclusive Funko Pop last year. So uh, yeah, if you want to collect stuff like that, you can. Here's the bandana, office mic. On it, it has coffee cups. It says, world's best boss. Of course, brand new with tags. This is, says, prison mic bandana. Okay, that's actually up here. You have like dundies on the sides of it. This will be for sale at my eBay store once again. You don't keep everything from every subscription box. Keep what you really want, sell the rest. And most of the time, you can probably get your money back if not make money on it. And keep the few items that you really like, sell the rest. And you can make money on these subscription boxes. That is not a lot. You can make money on these boxes. Okay, next item. I am not sure what this is. What is it? A tablecloth or something? Nope. Oh, looks like it's a uh, a grilling apron. Kevin's famous chili. To the tag says. Obviously, the episode where Kevin makes his famous chili. This says Kevin's famous chili costume apron. Okay. Oh, I see it now. It's Kevin in his suit with Ty holding that pot of chili from the episode. And we'll see what the actual apron says on it. It says, at least once a year, I like to bring some of, some of my Kevin's famous chili. The trick is to undercook the onions. Everybody is going to get to know each other in the pot. I'm serious about this stuff. I'm up the night before pressing garlic and dicing whole tomatoes. I toast my own ancho chilies. It's a recipe passed down from Malone's for generations. It's probably the, the thing I do best. Kevin Malone. I won't keep this. I'm being honest with you. Well, I'll be keeping what I'll be selling. Let's see next. We have a couple like hard items in here. We have, oh, last time we had a box like this, like, you know, like a paper box, plastic, had a little Dwight Schrute figure inside of it. This one says, The Office Beach Games Michael Scott collectible figure. We'll go ahead, crack this open and see what it looks like. I don't want to damage the box just in case I don't keep it. So I have a lot of figurines and collectibles already. I don't have room for everything. Okay, so Michael Scott is wrapped up. And there's Michael Scott in his beach clothes. What you can do, you put this on top of the lid, just like the from the Dwight from last quarter. You can display Michael Scott just like that on top of the paper box. Pretty cool. I know the Dwight shoe, I didn't keep it. I think I got like 25 bucks out of it too. It sold for pretty good money. That Dwight Schrute figure, I think I was the first one to list it on eBay, and it sold for really good money. So like that Dwight Schrute, or like even like this Michael Scott, if you really don't want these, list these little figures on eBay. They sell quick, and they sell for pretty good money. No joke. Okay, next item. we got a big box here. We have Sumo Match Pint Glass. It says... I never, I have never seen that look in a man's eyes ever. I thought that I might die on beach day. <laughs> Sumo match pint glass. You got that, that white styrofoam fuzzy stuff. And there's the pint glass. We got Stanley right there. Okay, pretty cool. I won't keep that though. Okay, next item. There's a lot of stuff in this box. We Oh, awesome. Chili Pot Kevin bobblehead. I'm not sure if I'll keep this or sell this, though. I think that actually might be it. Yeah, so, wow, that box is full of stuff again. It, all that was only $36. So, cheat sheet, back of it. Here's the front of the cheat sheet. That's what I'll be reading from. So we have the greetings from the Scranton Tee, the Kevin Ballone costume apron, Michael Scott Beach Games vinyl figure, prison Mike bandana, the bumper sticker, fax machine pin with letter, and Kevin Ballone bobblehead, all for $37. Okay, let's say if I sold everything in this box, how much could I make? The t-shirt, I tell you right now, that's 20 bucks. This is probably a good 15, 20, 30. Actually, I'd probably sell these, if I sold these two things together, probably, probably about 30 bucks. So t-shirt, these two things, there's 50. 
70 at least 20 bucks on this 70 80 and then the bandana and the pin the sticker probably about 90 bucks so i'm being honest with you you buy this for 30 36 bucks i wouldn't be too shocked if you sell everything here for 90 bucks you like i said you can make double if not triple your money on some of these boxes this thing was full of value if you're a fan of the office you like this box i like the box i like the office so i'll have the next box in the next corner let's see if it's as good as the first two the first two office boxes have been fantastic so i'll leave a direct link down below to culture fly the office box and the other boxes from culture fly it's good stuff see you next time